Hello, Internet. It's me. I'm talking to you from the future, and I want you to know it's not as dystopian as it seems. Hi, Nylon. I'm Natasha Leone, and today I'm giving it to you straight. You've got questions, and I've apparently got answers. Here's the situation. It's 2 a.m., and I'm locked out of my apartment. Honestly, what I would do, I'd go into the lobby of the Bowery Hotel. I'd walk to the front desk and I'd say, hey, listen, I'm staying here. I forgot my key. It's under a pseudonym. Yeah, I'm staying under Beach Blanket Bingo and see if that does anything. If it didn't, and I'd wander around and find a nice group of people and ask them for money. Your boyfriend doesn't get your sense of humor. Yes, it's a deal breaker. I don't know what to tell you. I'm sure the sex is terrific, but honestly, eh, you need to move on. Three movies you absolutely have to watch are Clockwork Orange, Knights of Kiberia, and Do the Right Thing. I'm riffing. Oftentimes, people will ask you in life, what's your favorite film? You don't have to answer that question. It's unreasonable. Same goes for your favorite book and also your favorite song. Also, probably you're never gonna end up on a deserted island, so you don't need to know the top five things you'd bring. Let's say you and your crush are not astrologically compatible. Is it relevant to your life? It's not. That's the secret. Now sure, you can Google it, you can look it up. It doesn't mean it's real. See, never trust space or time. It's a multiverse. It's a simulation. That said, I'm an Aries. No idea what rising. Probably Scorpio. Go, 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 go. One way to make yourself look expensive when you're broke is wearing black clothes. You want to wear as many black clothes at once as you can. Never wear yellow. Yellow is for borrowed clothes that you have to give back as soon as this interview is over. Always bet on black. Yes, get bangs. They'll cover half your face, which is the key to life. If we learn one thing from COVID, it's always cover at least half your face. It'll make you feel safer walking down the street. Ever since I got bangs, I feel much less vulnerable out in the world. And also, you don't have to get Botox because no one can see your forehead. Use your brain. Now you see, in life, if you want to be taken seriously as a person, you need information. You might think, you need to click a bunch of buttons on your phone, but sometimes you actually need to see the reference and then find out where it's from, read the book, watch the movie. People respect information. Let's say, and this has come up in my life many, many times, let's say your roommate is lying to you, he's eaten all your cashews. You wanna to get to the bottom of the mystery. Why is this guy a liar? Why are you living with him? Why do you have so many cashews? If you were a detective in Poker Face, what you would do is sniff out the lie, but not too hard if you were allergic to cashews. In honor of Russian Doll season two now streaming on Netflix, we're gonna talk a little bit about the return of the early aughts, the 90s. I would just say that something that the 90s had that I dearly miss is grunge. I remember when that happened, it was like a shock to the system. We thought we were doomed to a lifetime of pop. In came this raw and real thing, and gosh, I'm waiting for that to resurrect itself. Also, it turns out you don't have to buy your flannels online. You can go to a thrift store and find them. Sure, does it feel like societal collapse is in the air? We all know it does. How do you stay motivated? Well, gosh, I really don't know why, because I'm just a person. I'm right there with you. But, you know, you still got to live your life, tie your shoes, otherwise you'll trip and fall down the street. Nobody likes that. So I guess be nice to your pals. Try not to add to the problem wherever you can. And maybe in some small way each day, maybe it gets better. Probably not. Our New Year's resolution should probably be to, you know, remember that we're human. Sure, I'm not always sold on it. I'm not sold on us as a species. And uh, I'm not convinced that we really are here at all. But seemingly we're here having this experience together. So put a little bit of intention, love in your heart, pep in your step, and try to fight the good fight another day. We need you.